the playoffs. There can be heartbreak and there can be limbs. But one thing is for sure, the playoffs is bonkers. Tonight, I'll be travelling to Angus to watch Montrose versus Inverness in the Scottish League One playoff first leg. Tonight will be a very interesting game between two teams. First, Montrose, who have had an all right season, finishing fourth, just beating Cove Rangers to that playoff spot. Whereas Inverness, under new manager Duncan Ferguson, has not had the best of seasons, finishing in ninth, second last, and getting into a relegation playoff spot. The playoffs honestly could produce anything. It is a lottery, anyone can win, and that is why tonight will be such a good game. The winner of this tie will face Hamilton Academical or Alou Athletic. The last time Montrose were promoted to the championship was back in 1984-85 season. They will want to repeat that this season. The last time Inverness were promoted to the championship was back in 1996-97. They hope they do not go down. I am so excited for tonight. I thought, why not go to this game since this game means so much for either team. I'm sure the atmosphere at Lynx Park will be packed out for what is a massive occasion for the club. Let's get down to Angus. Welcome to Angus. We are in Montrose for a massive, I might have said League One playoff semi-final in my trailer video I did, but it is the championship semi-final first leg playoff between Montrose and Inverness Caledonian Thistle. I thought, why not go to this game? Very interesting, looking at the two teams, stats look very similar. Montrose had a good season, Inverness been good lately be a very very close game today Montrose I would say they're underdogs but the atmosphere of Lynx Park honestly it'll be buzzing tonight score prediction I'm gonna go I'm gonna go for a 1-1 I think it'll be a tight game again second leg on Saturday um, in Inverness I think it'll be a more tougher game for Montrose but I, I definitely know they want to get promoted into the championship and Inverness don't want to get relegated under big dunk. Apparently Jimmy Carragher's in the crowd today, so you never know, maybe get a selfie with him, the main man. But I'm quite surprised Inverness are in this situation because they've got a very, very good team. They've got Billy Mackay up front. They've got another m bunch of really, really good players. So um, it'll be a very, very close game tonight and I'm really looking forward to it. There are also more playoff games going on tonight. You have got, in the Premiership playoff, you have got Air Jones versus Park Thistle at the Excelsior Stadium. That would be a very, very good game. Um, you've also got, in the Championship playoff, you've got Aloha Athletic Hamilton, winner of the game I'm going to tonight. We'll play them. You've got Montrose and Vaness. You've also got, in the League One playoff, Dumbarton versus Sterling. In Dumbarton. And then you've also got Spar and Spearhead at Ainsley Park. Tonight, score predictions. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm saying 29 on one throws. <laughs> oh, yeah. I think it'll be a tough game. We've got a great defence, but I think we'll uh, just scrape it. 2 1 more. Saying a 4 0 more. Ryan Williamson, 4 goals. I'm going to say 7 0 on throws. Kane Hester, 6. Blair Lions, 1. Tea, 
Mm. That's smashing. Never been here before, but this stadium looks brilliant. Obviously, you've got the main stand there, and then you've pretty much just got terracing all around the stadium. Ultras over there should be going there for kickoff. Yeah, looks a really nice ground. Three, three now, Montos. Balloons are out. It's party mode. Here come the team. Half time, Montrose nil, Inverness nil. Very bland first half, I can't lie. Um, Inverness will get it back in the game. End of the second, end of the first half. Um, but Montrose have had the majority of chances. I think they're likely to score the next goal. I've heard Hamilton are beating Alawa, so that's a big score. Um, but yeah, we'll have to see in the second half. The atmosphere, the pyro at the start of the game was mental. So hopefully more of that in the second half. But it's half them here, Alex Park, it's nil nil. Okay, it's half time, nil nil. Do you think Montrose is going to win? Yeah! yeah. Full time prediction. And who, who's getting promoted? Full time prediction. Oh, no, no, I think it's going to be a draw. Alright, full time prediction. 
No, no. I no, no. I like one, 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 one. What do you think? I think one, one. One, one. Hang draw, I think. Take an evidence. Good to race for it. Montrose have got a very promising free kick here. If Montrose score, the stadium will go into delirium. Everyone's waiting. Can Montrose find the opener? Oh, it's in there. Here going Vaness. How's the point? Our attempt. Yeah, okay, so there. full time nil nil. We've got Sam North back on the channel. Go subscribe to his channel. Thank you, mate. Um, what do you thought of that game? Oh, Montrose were unlucky, weren't they? Yeah. I feel like uh, they missed a few chances. But Inverness, I, I don't feel like they really they had a couple of chances in the game. They never had a spell of dominance, did they? Yeah. I feel like uh, it was a little bit like obviously one team's in the championship, one's League One. It looked like the roles were reversed. It seemed yeah. like Montrose were the championship side and Inverness were the League One side. But um, credit to Montrose, they made it really hard for Inverness, and it's going to be an interesting game on Saturday, isn't it? Yeah. That is, how can I say this, a crazy experience at Lynx Park tonight. Um, it was a pretty boring game. I thought Montrose deserved to win the game, actually. I thought they were the better team. They looked more like the championship team. Turn left onto Field Road. But, again, the, the, the fans were brilliant and, honestly, Better than I ever thought. The pirates for the game. The pirates before the game, they were brilliant. Uh, the atmosphere is brilliant. Great to have Sam North for Adventures back on the channel. Honestly, please go subscribe to him. He's doing amazing content for Scottish football. And um, yeah, he's on the road to 200,000 subscribers. So go subscribe to him right now. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you did enjoy it. I might be going to Peterhead Spartans on the weekend. We'll have to see. But thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time.